Are you in danger of losing your house? Have you missed mortgage payments? Are you behind on property taxes? Or do you have a loan that's about to reset and increase your mortgage payments? Or, like many today, have you come to the conclusion that you just can't afford your house anymore? Unfortunately, this problem is not going to go away and many people that find themselves in this situation do not know what to do next. There are three actions you can take. If you have equity in your house, you can refinance to a lower rate and bring your payments down. You can also try a loan modification, but one of the unintended consequences of a loan modification is foreclosure, which many people are not aware of and the banks don't tell you. 100,000 homes a month are foreclosed upon in America right now, and most of these people have tried loan modifications. There is a third option, and that's a short sale. A short sale, when conducted properly, will allow you to sell your home for less than the loan. There will be no deficiency judgments. The banks will not come after you. It takes three to four months to get approved, and you'll be able to stay in your home and not make a single payment during that period. If you get to the point where a short sale is your only option or the best option for you, we can help. My team consists of two attorneys, a paralegal, and two full-time bank negotiators. We know how to deal with the banks. When we submit our short sale packages, we submit them under the name of the law office. You no longer have to deal with the bank, we do the negotiating for you. If you have any questions of the attorneys, you can speak to them directly. There's no cost to you. In fact, there are no fees. You pay no commissions or legal fees. The best way to proceed is to send me an email, briefly explain your situation. Or if you have specific questions, send me an email. I'll be more than happy to ask them for you. In closing, I would like to leave you with this thought. If you are thinking of doing a loan modification, ask your bank one question. Do you own my loan? If they say no, then please click on the link that we have provided at Mother Jones. You'll be surprised by what you see. We hope you find this information helpful, and if you feel that I can be of service, please send me an email. Thank you.